We didn't really talk about the carriage house. Talk, what's the program for the carriage house? Could you say um, one bedroom or studio or? Yeah, I mean, I, it's it's going to be. I don't know. They, they may, we've thrown around the idea of a murky bed. I mean, they make really good murky beds nowadays. So if if it needs to be a studio, we could do something like that. They want a little kitchenette, you know, just like a little spot so that they can have kind of some space when they come visit for you know a few weeks at a time. And then probably at least a double bed, maybe a queen bed in there. Okay. And then full bathroom. Yes. Staff washer dryer. I mean, yeah, I and mean, we're we're open to I don't know how what you guys think of the washer dryers that are combo. I used to have one of those that was like a washer and a dryer, so it'd be more compact. Okay. All right, so a little washer dryer space, kitchen space, low living space, bedroom space. Mm -hmm. which may require all of this bedroom square footage, which means that, and the garage square footage, which means the garage might need to be a little bit oversized, or we eat into, we eat into some other connecting stuff, if you will. What's the rough price point on like this lot that for the land? Do you have an idea at this point, and you may not, Kevin, on the size of the carriage house? Yeah, I mean, you can, you can make it as small as possible, as large as possible. But if we just start, if, if, if we start with, if we just started Rob with something like this, don't don't. I'm gonna do something crazy like bring this in four feet, and then like the house of four gables, you know that sort of thing, or or maybe it's just got a larger gable at the back. But as we start doing a shape like this. And then are you okay if it has some pitched, you know, ceilings to it as a space kind of living up in the loft, you know, if you yeah. will. Yeah. So if we started a shape like this, right? Well, I can answer your question. That is 350 square feet. You get a kitchen. What would you get a kitchen laundry? I mean, that's 13 feet. It's 14 feet with the walls, but 13 feet on the inside. So with that space, I'm just going to go with something real quick here. Just sorry. You think we could just grab checks without having to go steal it? So maybe, maybe there's a little bit of living space here. Here's where bit, not the road is, but the windows are part of the architecture. And then they're also part of the, well, we, we, have, we need to put things there. Yeah. So it's like, if we just say, like, we're going to have a little table over here for some dining, a living, living over here, we still don't have a bed area. And do we partition this off for a bed area? Or do we start growing this this way and then growing this this way? Meaning, okay, what if it's a Murphy bed? Yeah, that's why that's we're pitching out that idea. I mean, they make some really good Murphy beds nowadays. 